Nearly two in five Americans' emergency funds will not last longer than one month. Today, Scott Toma, Principal and Client Needs Research at Edward Jones, is here to share how people can improve their financial wellness. Hi, how are you doing today? Doing great, Naila. Thank you for having me. Yes, thank you for being here. So tell me, how can Americans improve their financial wellness, especially amid uncertain economic times? Well, we saw several things in the survey that they are trying to do today. Things like building their emergency fund, paying down debt, starting a monthly budget, and then sticking with it. Those are all fantastic options to be able to start building that stability in their financial wellness. But one of the things I'll highlight is that sort of seems like a lot. You don't have to do it all at once. It's important to start making steps along the way. And the other thing we found is that working with a financial advisor to help build a plan in place to prioritize those items was critical in helping people reach that financial wellness. Interesting. So tell me, how can a financial advisor impact a financial wellness strategy? Well, I'd say it's a significant impact, and it's really from two different perspectives. Certainly on the money side of things, we found that 80% of individuals who worked with a financial advisor had $1,000 or more in an emergency fund versus only about a third who didn't work with a financial advisor. But I'd say it's much more than money. It's providing that confidence. Individuals who worked with a financial advisor were twice as confident in their financial strategy versus those who didn't. And I really think that's all about having a strategy or a plan in place and then feeling better prepared to navigate those inevitable ups and downs that we're going to see. Americans take to build their emergency savings. Well, I'd say there's several things. First and foremost, make it automatic. Many individuals have money coming out of their paycheck every single month to save for retirement, and that's a fantastic start. Do the exact same thing for your emergency fund. Allocate a little bit every month, have it going out automatically, and then it's sort of out of sight, out of mind. Secondly, it's tax season right now. For those who may be receiving a tax refund, what a great opportunity to use that refund as a foundation for your emergency fund. And third, look at your budget. You may have subscriptions that you're not using right now. A great opportunity to cancel those, take that money, and use that to also allocate towards your emergency fund as well. This is all great information. Where can we go to learn more? You can go to our website, it's edwardjones.com slash financial wellness. Not only can you find the information I provided today, you can also find information to find a financial advisor in your area. Awesome. Thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you for having me.